The works of Caspar David Friedrich hang back in Berlin's National Gallery now. But some of these iconic German landscapes have in the past been part of a diplomatic mission to China that's ongoing. In 2016, the gallery's Egyptian artefacts will travel to Beijing for the latest jointly curated exhibition. The Chinese embassy's cultural attaché says collaboration can be a rewarding challenge. So we have a, a different background, a different culture, uh, so uh, with uh, the different thinking. Yeah? Yeah. So, uh, but I think it's uh, most interesting actually for the exchange uh, between uh, two countries or between uh, institutions. Yeah? It's not easy, but uh, uh, we can understand us. Yeah? We can we can understand each other. Then uh, we can offer. Uh, our position, our opinion, and the European countries, the European people will offer their uh, opinions. This year saw China 8 grace the banks of the Rhine in Western Germany, the largest show of contemporary Chinese art ever outside China. Thousands came to view it. Museum officials seemed passionately enthused about their contribution. Political and, and, and economical relations some, sometimes are based on cultural exchange and um, about the knowledge of each other and how to behave and how to get along with each other. Well, the global art world is um, maybe more advanced than the global political world because we can speak the same language and we, we speak about the same things. Two rich cultural histories building mutual understanding.